Good morning. Doom, 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 doom. Be happy. As y'all can see, y'all praise to the most high God. Another blessed day, another blessed morning. And this Brussels sprout plant, which we didn't get any Brussels sprouts from, but I left it here in this bed. As you can see, I covered, pulled the other ones. And um, I left this one because it started bolting. And I know a lot of people pull out their plants when they start bolting, but that's good news for us unless we immediately trying to plant in that space. But this is in a brassica family, so I probably could have pulled it up and put it in a pot. And it still would have did this, but I left it in place. And this is the most flush. Look at that. This is going to give us thousands and thousands and thousands of seeds. You understand that? I, I can't say how many seeds in each one of these things. If it was 10, you get the picture. See those little pod looking things here? Like little bitty mini string beans. All those going to be seeds, including all those yellow flowers through the grace of God that you see right there. And let me show you what's going on on this kale. This is a brief morning update. Look at here. Here go the kale, y'all. All of them full of seeds. And I pulled these straight out of the ground, put them in pots, and you couldn't even tell I touched them. I did it with kale, but, you, you know, you still couldn't really tell that I touched them. But can y'all see that? So, and seeds is a big deal right now. Getting emails about seed shortages and certain seed companies, they can't, they suspending orders and stuff because of a seed shortage, man. People out here panicking, man, and just buying up everything it looked like. But this is the type of stuff we're going to have to start back doing. So, look, we got the seeds going there. Um, oh, here, let me show y'all these. That's the Alibaba watermelon coming back. That's the cabbage, the uh, Chinese cabbage. Tomatoes back there. That's the dinosaur kill back there. And they go to amaranth, as you can see. They spring up like that, and we probably got a billion or more amaranth seeds. Red amaranth, that is. There goes some more tomatoes. What? No, those was Romans on my left. Romans, y'all. These are the black vernissage or whatever you want to call them. These are basil, look at them. A few basil, need a lot more. Alibaba springing up over here as well. I planted another seed because I didn't know if our seeds was doing good. <clears throat> but it just took a little patience. It is cold, it's chilly today. You know, um, but I'll praise it to the most high. Feel me? Our seedlings are doing great. Seedlings are doing great, praise God. Look at all of this. Look at them little third leaves coming up on that Swiss chart there. This is the red Aztec spinach. Not as many seeds sprouted. I don't know if they last this long. I might have to refrigerate some of this amaranth we got because they're in the same family. I wanted to last. But I think the third leaves are, yeah, we about to get some third leaves on these. So in the meantime, I'm just we're just babying these up. That's all. Feel me? So. That's saving seeds too through the grace. That's the seed of seedling and seed update. Yeah.